Welcome back. Ever heard of Smoosh? Your kids might have. They are a popular new local band, and they're made up of two sisters. Pretty hot right now in the world of indie rock, but this isn't your usual Seattle garage band. As Como's Joe Furia shows us, these rockers are just 10 and 12 years old. Uh-huh, yo, guys. This is Chloe. She's 10. See, I really care where I go. Her sister, Asi, is 12. Together, they make up one of the Northwest's hottest new indie bands. Smoosh. I don't know, I just get this like really great feeling when I'm up, when I'm up playing at the shows. Never heard of them? You will. Ossie and Chloe are making a name for themselves, opening for such bands as Pearl Jam, Sleater Kinney, and Death Cab for Cutie. These girls write all their own songs, music, and lyrics. We had like a small keyboard, and I'd always play it, and then I made like songs and stuff. And when Chloe got a drum set, we just started doing it together, so that's kind of how it all got started. Smoosh just put out their first CD, She Like Electric, and critics love it. Darlings of the local music scene, said our newspaper partner, the Seattle PI. The Oregonian called the new CD truly exciting. Sweet, perfect pop numbers, wrote Rock Girl magazine, and the stranger said simply, Smoosh is awesome. <laughs> All the attention could easily swell the heads of ones so young, but their dad tells me that has not happened. They have really level heads about it, and that, that really relieves me and you know encourages me that you know we can keep moving forward with this. I would be worried if that wasn't the case. Do you have two ends? Yeah. And while they're becoming known for their music, music is not all they know. They play soccer, go to school, hang out with friends, all the things kids their age do. It wouldn't be fun if I never got any time to do anything else. But when they're into their music, it's special. The hooks, the melodies, they just get it. And they love sharing it with their fans. If there's like a bigger crowd, like then I feel like I could like rock out and then, and then I'd be happy if the crowd would like clap or something. The lead singer of another Northwest band, Harvey Danger, may have put it best when he said of Smoosh, they're not just good for their age, they're just good. Uh-huh, uh-huh, yo, yo. In Seattle, Joe Furia, Como, uh -huh, for News. Uh -huh. Yo, guys. And joining me now are Chloe and Aussie. Good to have you here. Better known as Smoosh. Thank you for being here. First of all, how'd you guys come up with the name, Smoosh? Um, well, we used to like the band Smash Mouth, and we wanted to think of something like that, so it was Smush, but everyone just pronounced it Smoosh, so we just decided to Call it smoosh. So it went from smo smush to smoosh. Yeah. Okay. How did you guys get started? Um. Well, Aussie's played all played all her life, and then I got my drum set when I turned six. We decided. I guess we just decided to be in a band. You did. You just made up your mind you were going to do this. Well, I already had songs, and uh -huh. then when she got her drum set, she started to play with me in the song. So, and then we had like we had a, we made a CD and stuff. So. You made a CD and stuff. Now, when do you guys find time to write songs and music and make CDs and stuff? Um, we used to be homeschooled, so I think that's it was easier to do when you're homeschooled because you don't have all the homework and stuff. Right. But now we just kind of work around the school and all of our other stuff. And you're 10 years old and you're 12 years old, Other right? way around. Other way around. I always yeah. get this fixed up. Now, we put together a little mini vi video from one of their CDs. It's the song called Rad. Can you tell me what the song's about? Um, it's kind of about, like, somebody just trying to go out and do your best, you know? Don't, like, hold back. It doesn't matter if you make mistakes. You have to take risks and stuff. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of, like, optimistic. All right. Well, here's a little clip from Rad. Yo, yo. Uh huh, uh huh. Yo, guys. Everyone, I'm not feeling bad today. Cause maybe you should be a little unhappier. Everyone wants to feel now. Shouldn't make any mistakes, but it was bad. See, now I just gotta grab where I can. I'm helping you with the sad if I'm mad if you're not happy. That's great. See, everyone should be. And we're seven and your feet to the beat. I think that's great. If it's time to play, go play. Night football, maybe soccer. Can't on a soccer team. You can have them. Yo. Oh, 
Oh, you guys are good. Nicely done. Thanks. Now, this week, you, you've been playing, opening for some pretty big bands, Pearl Jam, and this week, it's a band called Jimmy Meets World, Jimmy Eat World, right? Yeah. In Vancouver. <laughs> now, tomorrow night, you open for the Presidents of the United States of America. Your CD, this is your CD, it's called She Like Electric. Right, yeah. and, and you, it's in most local record stores now, isn't it? And what's it like to walk in and see your CD over there in Tower Records? It's really cool, because, I mean, um, we never had our CD in before. It's the first time, so I get to see it, like, everywhere. And I don't know, just, I like it. Cool. And your friends think this is pretty cool, don't they? Yeah. Yeah? Uh -huh. it's pretty cool. Do you guys have a favorite band? Do you have favorite music you like to listen to? Um, I have favorites. I like, well, I like The Presidents, uh -huh. Death Cab for Cutie. Slater, Katie, so. All right, well, we'll be watching for you. Smoosh, thank you very much for being here. Congratulations, good job, girls. Thanks. She like electric.